Welcome back. Do you need a little motivation to help you get up and moving? That's right. Our lifestyle <laughs> correspondent Stephanie Walters has tips from snacks to things you mm -hmm. can use around your home to keep fit. All right, so just because you're stuck in the house and your favorite restaurants are closed, your favorite gyms are closed, does not mean this is the chance to fall off the wagon. You still have to be accountable and you still need to be active. And the first thing we need to talk about is what you're snacking on every day. So I know right now a lot of people are doing an extended happy hour, but a great way to be accountable for this is to kind of like what I like to call it, cut your wine. So what we've done here, we've just poured like three ounces of wine and then you want to cut it with a little bit of sparkling water. It still gives you the same flavor, but now you have have half the calories. I know it might not be as fun, but it's a great way to stay accountable and less calories that you're indulging in. Another great way to do this is to pour your wine and mix it with a, maybe a juice or a sparkling water into ice trays and put it in the freezer and let it freeze and then put it into like your favorite soda or juice. That way you're getting less of the calories, but you're still getting that flavor you want. Let's talk about the food because I know a lot of us are sitting on the couch and binge eating, but opt for different levels of snacks. So instead of going for the cookies, try going for the graham crackers. I know it might seem a little different than what you're used to, but this is a really good way to still make sure you're eating healthy, but also enjoying the flavor of your snacks. And then we also want to get into your vitamins. Don't forget to stop taking these. Right now with all the disease that's happening, we still want to keep our immune system boosted. So we've got turmeric, we've got biotin. These are a great way to just keep your immune system on the up and up as we're facing these uncertain times. Now we've got the food down pack. Now I'm going to show you the things that you can use in your house to still stay accountable by working out. All right, so we've talked about our healthy eating and now we need to get into the actual physical activities. If it's a nice day like today, you can come outside and use the items that you have in your home. Don't have weights, no problem. We've got two half gallons of milk that you can just do some bicep curls. You can integrate different exercises with this. I mean, I know it's like not the gym, but it's just a fun way to just get active. Maybe do this a couple times a day, take breaks. There's a lot of different activities you can do with jugs of milk. If you don't have jugs of milk, you can use bottles of wine. A great way to just be active in this time, being stuck in the house. I wanna show you some other ways that you can also utilize the furniture that's in your home. So you can use a chair. Like I said, we can do indoors or outdoors. You're gonna get on it and you're just gonna do your dips. This is also another really easy activity. So you're not just standing all day or sitting on the couch or in front of your computer all day. Make sure you take the necessary breaks. Also do your regulars, your jumping jacks, your stretches, your lunges, your squats. There's no excuse why you cannot get physically fit during this time of quarantine. And lastly, probably one of the most important things right now is to stay mentally fit. I know this time is tough for everyone, but there's a couple things you can do to keep your mind just happy and engaged during this time. So my first thing is set the atmosphere, whether you have fresh flowers or faux flowers, just having something like this to brighten up your day kind of just changes your mood. And then I swear by these things, it's a white noise machine. So for those of you who are having difficulty sleeping right now, this is a great purchase. You can look online, purchase this anywhere right now, it really helps you go to sleep peacefully. I know with practicing social distancing, we're not allowed to actually go to these places, but supporting your local businesses is really important right now. So those who provided services such as massages and meditation stations and, and fitness classes, they're now transitioning to online spaces. So please go support them. And also a lot of your big companies are doing free online consultations, free setups. This is just a wonderful time to stay mentally fit with all the resources there and make sure you check in with your therapist. I know a lot of them are doing virtual classes as well. And if you need some more tips, make sure you log on to my website at stephwalterstv.com and find me on social media at Steph Walters TV. Be safe and be well. Thank yes. you so much. Those are great tips, Stephanie. Jason is I'm doing inspired. his dips right off of our stage here, Stephanie. So yes. she would be very proud of you. <laughs>